Hey everyone, it's Nahar and in this video I would like to show you how to use the new bulk scanner, the Zeek Pro tools. So as you can see we are here in one uh, of the uh, sellers in the competitor research like you used to do before, you come inside competitor and you click on the bulk scanner. Before when you clicked here you had a pop-up open and you fill the filters and you filter and then you wait till the uh, software scan this seller. So what we did is basically we just uh, skipped this part and uh, created an instant scan. So once you click bulk scanner, okay, uh, in this moment, uh, Zeek have added this seller to your Zeek Pro Tools to the bulk scanner and it's ready to view. You click one more time here and you open uh, the bulk scanner, the Zeek Pro Tools, and here you have the list of your sellers. You click on the seller here and uh, you get uh, inside uh, the seller and you can find all the items from eBay and all the items from Amazon. You can have the statistics here, the name of the seller, the country, everything. So you have enough information to take decisions. And you have here the filters as well. Okay. So you can filter uh, by sales in the last 7 to 30 days. Let's go for 30 days, for example, and say I want maximum items. I want item that sold minimum 2 units in the last 30 days. And I click filter. Once I click filter, Zeke will show me all those items. As you can see here, I have... 52 items that sold um, more than two times in the last 30 days okay if i will go back one time and i will click here again i just want to show you uh, that uh, the back the new bulk scanner found 95 items from 146 successful listings so basically found more than a half that it's a lot you filter anything you want. Okay, you click here. Now, now I made three sales in the last 30 days. I saw that there is 12 items with three sales. And what I need to do now is move it to the folder. Okay, so uh, if you don't know how to create folder, you go to management panel, my folders, and uh, you create a folder. You checkbox all the items. You choose the folder you want to move the item to. Okay, you click on move to folder. And in this moment, all the item move to this folder. All you need to do is to go to your uh, folder here. I made test five to go to the folder, uh, open the folder and just checkbox everything or checkbox some of the items you want or, or you decide what you do. And from here, list them uh, directly to your store or with integration or just export list and download it uh, to your item to your uh, csv file what else you can do here uh, you have the not found items okay this can help you to get to items that any software can't find so you go here to not found items and you have the list of the items we couldn't find z couldn't find and also other sellers can't find other softwares can't find those uh, items usually with low competition okay because uh, scrapers can't find them and again you can filter filter here again so let's go for last 30 days uh, one sale click filter okay and then we get all the items with more than one sales in the last 30 days we have 223 items all you need to do is do it yourself or let your VA go one by one, add the ASIN, choose the folder. You can also make, uh, uh, you can choose folder for same folder for all items or specific folder to each item. Depends how you collect your items, if it's based on price, profit or whatever. And add, put ASIN, click save, put ASIN, click save and collect all those items as scrapers can't find. This way you cover 100% of the items. You don't have scanning times. You don't have any issue of waiting for the scanning times like you had before. You can just walk non-stop, filter all what you want, do it very accurate, very fast and cover 100%. I hope this was useful. And uh, remember, you need to use the folders. You move the items from here to the folders and you list them to your store or you export CSV file. Thank you very much, guys.